Every day as business owners and salespeople, we start the day at the same starting line. But your day is full of obstacles and diversions. Keeping yourself focused on growing your business and maximizing revenue is a challenge. This podcast is designed to help you get better every day so you can meet and exceed the challenges as they come your way. Ladies and gentlemen, it's time. Let's dominate the day. Every business owner alive talks about their brand. My brand. I'm trying to build my brand. You know who you are. Yet here I am sitting in my Dominate office with my Dominate t-shirt, looking at Dominate hats, looking at Dominate mugs. I'm all about the brand. I love the brand. I love our logo and I love to see it on people. So what are a couple of ways that you can get your brand exposed in your marketplace? An easy thing to do is to create gear. That's what we do. Um, when we're at conferences, we give gear away. Uh, when I speak at events, I give gear away, whether it be a hat, shirt, pullover, whatever it may be, I give that gear away. And then people wear that gear, tag me in that gear, show people that gear, and Dominate Partners gets exposed. You can do the same thing with your local business, create gear, and give it away. Things like t-shirts, hats, mugs. Who do you give them to? Give them to your clients, your commercial clients, your residential clients. People love, first of all, people love free stuff. They just do. Give somebody a free hat, free shirt. Oh my God, you're better than their grandma making them chocolate pudding on a hot summer day. They want that gear. So find places where you can create gear inexpensively that looks good. Secondly, have a logo that's memorable. One of my favorite things about our brand is it spells out dominate like a license plate, like my, fun, like, like my uh, good friend Donnie Baker says. It's dominate like a license plate. And we create memorability with that logo and with our name. Same thing with you. Create memorability with your logo. Create it with the materials that you provide. And create it in a way to where you're getting your brand out as much as possible. The third thing to do is make sure you're giving a lot of that stuff away. You know, give away 10 hats and you expect those 10 hats to be seen in a population of 100,000. Not going to happen. Give away a thousand hats. Now you're talking. Put a coffee mug on every real estate agent's desk. Now you're talking. Give you know a couple of sports teams uh, sponsorships so they put their logo on your on their uh, uniforms. Now you're talking. Those are the kinds of things that help to create branding. Along with you know your trucks being wrapped, that brand being on your website, your uh, every piece of marketing material that you provide and present has that branding on there. But you have to do something creative to, to, to really get that brand to go, the word is viral, but that's really not the correct word, but to, to become memorable. So I recommend hats, t-shirts, mugs, anything that people can wear, anything that people can put on and uh, walk around in your in your marketplace is going to help you expose your brand to as many people as possible. And when people get to know who and what your brand is, that's when you're going to start to see the effects of that brand really bring in eyeballs to your website, eyeballs uh, on what it is you're doing on social media, and it'll help you dominate the day.